I used to be an adventurer like you. And I took an arrow in the knee. Hello to all the peoples of Nine Delora and welcome to the channel. Well, it's come to my attention that there are people that have not upgraded to Skyrim 1.6 and the Decoration Club content that it contains and that they are still using Skyrim version 1.5.97. If you've been following my mods recently, you will know that I've been requiring the creation club content on my mods however there are there are people that are using 1.5.97 that are not able to use those mods so i need to backdate them to make them compatible with that and i use xedit to do that but before we get into this little tutorial Let's get this YouTube stuff out of the way. If you like the content and it teaches you something, remember to smash that like button and share it on your social media. Also, leave a comment because it turns out that the YouTube algorithm really loves that sort of thing. If you guys want to support the channel directly, use the Ko-Fi link in the description. You can join as a channel member there or do a one-time tip and ko-fi doesn't charge you for tipping the channel otherwise smash that join button or that like but that thanks button underneath the video okay let's get into this tutorial all right so what i'm what i'm doing is i am going to back port my ultra my ultimate nordic carved armor mod I just put up I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna copy this now this requires this still requires the CC content and all that so I'm gonna copy the plugin and I'm going to paste it right into my data folder just like that now I'm gonna open up my X edit and find this here and you can see Right here, this, the ultimate Nordic carved armor requires the unofficial Skyrim special edition patch. Now that I'm going to have to put back in after I get done with this, but it requires all of the CC content as well as hearth fires. So we're going to go ahead and push OK on that and let this load up. And it's probably going to pop a notification at you if you've got the patch the USAP, but it didn't so that's fine and this is already flagged as an esl what i'm going to do is i'm going to right click on this on my one i want right click on this go down and i'm going to select clean masters and it'll say are you absolutely sure yes yes i am and that is done now when you close it it'll pop this window here and i'll say do you want to save this one yes i do now i'm going to go ahead and i'm going to open up my creation kit and then i'm going to open up this here i'm going to set this as an active file now you can see on the parent masters all it requires now is the skyrim the update the dawn guard and the dragonborn I'm going to want to add the USEP patch and I'm going to add the hearth fires patch just because. And I'm going to make that an active file and I'm going to click save. Let these load the files up. And it doesn't take very long since I'm using creation kit tweaks and fixes, which you can find on the Nexus. If you use Creation Kit a lot, it loads it up a lot quicker. And just to make sure that I'm 
just to make sure I'm doing the right one, I'm going to want to go here and I'm going to chew, I'm going to type in Nordic in the filter so that it shows me everything. And you can see I've got extra, a bunch of extra Nordic stuff down here. I added in and this is this and you can see that the meshes say 3BA so yes I'm good here so I'm just going to save this and that is done and I'm going to close the kit I'm going to copy this and then I'm going to paste this in right here. So this is fixed. Now, I actually have to, to do this, I actually have to modify this. So what I'm gonna do is, is I'm going to open up my FOMOD creation tool here and I'm going to open file Go to my desktop, find that folder, and I'm going to want to go ahead and click on that. Now, what I want to do is I'm going to put CBBE 1.5.97, and I'm going to choose to select any, and I'm going to copy this name here for the ESP and I'm going to paste that in right there. I'm going to go back over here. I'm going to add this in, make sure that's highlighted and I'm going to add that. Now I'm going to do the same thing here, except I'm going to go 3BA 1.5.97. Just like that i'm going to add that and then i'm going to add that i'm going to go back here i'm going to choose my image just like that go to the 3ba choose my image just like that and then i want to go ahead and i want to add file or yeah add file and i'm going to go to the this is the cbbe and I want to add these right here. And then I want to add the folder, which is body slide files. And then I want to slow click on this here. And I want to remove everything before the name here, where it says data and all this. I want to remove this like this and then make it just say Calente Tools right there. That's ready. And I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna do the same thing, except this time I'm gonna do it with my 3BA, the one I just did, just like this. Open those, add the folder, just like that. And remember, this is just slow click. You click once, wait a second, click again, and it should just do it. There we go. And I want to go ahead and do this all like this, just like that. And that is ready. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to save my FOMOD just like that. That's done. Go to exit because it doesn't like it when you start screwing around. And then I'm going to repack this faux mod and I'll be uploading this to the mod page on Shaken Mods. Now, if you guys don't know about Shaken Mods, Shaken Mods is an alternative to the Nexus. Uh, I think it's better because download speeds are blazingly fast. They're really fast. So, plus... Uh, the Shaken Mods administrators, they don't, they're, they're not overbearing. They don't, they don't, you know, if, 
they don't allow people to you know make nasty comments on your mods that 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 stuff doesn't go on there's not as much toxicity which is a great thing because there's a lot of uh with with the nexus and lovers lab there's a lot of toxicity that goes on there and it's just not worth it so we got this we got this getting all packed up and it's about done it's like at 90 percent and it will be done here directly and once it is there it is and it is done there we go all right that's gonna be it for this one guys uh hope you guys learned some and thanks for watching remember if you guys enjoyed the content and or you learned something remember to smash that like button leave a comment underneath the video on how useful it was to you and don't forget to share it on your social media okay until next time guys remember to keep your sword sharp don't be a milk drinker and always watch the skies traveler